Police are investigating after someone fired a gun just outside Dick's Sporting Goods at Greenwood Park Mall. No one was hurt, but the incident was unsettling for shoppers and employees months after the mass shooting at the mall's food court. WRTV's Nico Panisi tells us about one couple who witnessed that commotion firsthand and why they say they're tired of the violence. A last minute run to the mall quickly turned to pandemonium for Lisa and Anthony Bridges. I was at Luxury Nails where I was getting my nails done and he had just went down to JD's and he had bought me my Christmas present. Then gunshots. We heard um, a loud pop. Greenwood police responded to the parking lot outside the Dick's Sporting Goods for an active shooter situation late Friday afternoon. No one was shot, but people like the Bridges knew they needed to get to safety. When they saw two other women paralyzed in fear, Anthony sprang into action. Well, I, I just didn't want nobody to get hurt. I said, but you need to go to the back because we, we don't know if they're coming through here or not because people were just running everywhere. Greenwood Assistant Chief of Police Matthew Fillenworth says one person fell and injured themselves in all the commotion. At this time, police do not know how many people were involved or how many shots were fired. Multiple individuals, what we know at this point, were outside the mall in the parking lot, just outside the Dick's and the old Sears entrance, and were shooting at each other. Phil and Warth says the snow, wind, and extremely cold temperatures are making this investigation even more daunting. But in any incident, it's always confusion until you get your resources there and you get things under control and you start to understand what are we dealing with and then how do we deal with it. The incident comes months after a mass shooting inside the Greenwood Park Mall food court in July, a tragedy that was on the bridge's minds tonight. Indiana's gotten so bad. Yeah. We're just trying. You can't to... go anywhere no more. Yeah. Working for you, Nico Panisi, WRTV.